UK Games Expo is Britain's largest tabletop gaming event with more than 39,000 visitors over three days. Here are our top nine and three quarter reasons that we want to attend. Are you not listening? It's Britain's largest tabletop gaming event. You just won't believe how vastly, hugely, mind-bogglingly big it is. I mean, you may think it's a long way down the road to the chemists, but that's just peanuts compared to the UK Games Expo. Not only does it take up several halls of one of Britain's largest convention centres, but most of the nearby Hilton Hotel too. If you only go to one event this year, it will undoubtedly give you the most choice for your buck, including RPGs, spaceship simulators, card game tournaments, playtesting miniatures, awesome food trucks, and even Vikings. As well as game designers and publishers, many recognisable faces from the media will be there. Birmingham is pretty much dead centre of England, and it's a major transport hub with extensive rail links. It even has its own airport, serving 150 cities in the UK, Europe, and even as far away as New York, Delhi, and Dubai. There are free shuttle buses, and even a monorail, which you can totally ride for free as many times as you like. All this makes it easier to stay off-site and commute in, saving you money. Money which you can spend at more than 350 exhibitors from all over the world. You can buy direct from many games publishers or there are plenty of well-known retailers. Make sure you come back last thing on a Sunday to haggle your way into some sweet deals. If you love queuing and you love a bargain, UK Games Expo holds one of the world's largest gaming bring and buy sales. This is a great opportunity to pick up some barely used games on the cheap, to round out your collection, pick up a filler game to amuse you in the evening, or stumble across an ancient long out of print gem from your childhood. Plus, if you're on a budget, you can turn some of your games into cash, which you can spend on more games. There are thousands of potential buyers, and you won't need to fork out for postage like selling on eBay. If you have gone a bit crazy with all those sweet bargains and don't fancy carting armfuls of boxes around all day, check out the Shop and Drop service. It's like a cloakroom for games, instead of cloaks. For £3, they will store all of your games all day long, and you can keep coming back and adding more without an additional charge. But do remember to pick them up at the end of the day, as nothing is stored overnight. If at the end of the show you have too many purchases for your train, plane or automobile, then you can use the pack and post service offered by Games Law. There is food in the exhibition centre, plus the nearby hotels and station are chock full of restaurants, bars and coffee places. There are plenty of outlets to pick up some bottled water to keep you hydrated too. The stars of the show are the food trucks, however, where you can get artisan food cooked fresh. Make sure you avoid the rush hours of lunchtime and tea time if you're in a hurry. If you play most games solo or two-player, or if you fancy a change from your usual gaming group, then there are no shortage of gamers to fill those five- and six-player games. How about an 18-player game of Mega Civilization? Whilst everyone can play games at home or shop online, the Expo offers many shows that you need to attend, such as The Dark Room or Nightmare Live. These are great comedy shows that will help you relax after a hard day's shopping or reading the rules of your 10th new game. Many of these are highly regarded, often award-winning performances, never seen outside top festivals like the Edinburgh Fringe. With this being the world's third largest hobby event, you are bound to see something that you haven't seen before. And we aren't just talking about the 203 brand new games or all the prototypes in the playtest zone. We're talking about really freaky stuff, like the jet black double-decker bus. Or what the heck is that? Seriously, that scared the bejesus out of us. WTF, man! We have just scratched the surface of this amazing event. If you want more information, their website has extensive info about travel, accommodation, toilets, car parking and more, as well as selling tickets for the expo and any events. The best thing to do is download this year's program as a PDF, which will be given away free as a booklet when you attend. This has a concise summary of everything that is going on, location maps, exhibitors lists and more adverts than you can shake a stick at. Cool, eh? So give this event some serious thought. Maybe pop up for a day trip.